Okay, so what is up everyone? This is Kiran here. Welcome back to Tech Kiran YouTube channel. Pixie SOS V4.0.5 Google Apps Build which I have installed on my Redmi Note 8. It's based on Android version 11 with the March security patch. The April security patch custom rooms are also coming very soon. I'll make a review on those but this one is the Pixie SOS which is actually kind of a pixel experience room but not but with some interesting kind of extra features which you get here. For example, you have some extra customization includes status bar related customizations, notifications, customizations which I'm gonna share with you. First of all, the thing is it's based on Android version 11. This is kind of a latest Android version as Android version 12 is also coming very soon but right now we have Android 11 based custom rooms and some custom rooms are even not stable on Android version 11 and we are expecting Android version 12 very very soon. But right now we have Android 11 based Pixie SOS based Pixie OS for the Redmi Note 8 users. Also it is a me it's actually a unified build so can be installed on Redmi Note 8 and Redmi Note 8T both of the devices. The default wallpaper look is now changed here if you install pixie os previous builds the default wallpaper in this build is actually changed and this default wallpaper looks better than the previous one talking about the smoothness as expectedly it's quite good also it's avsp based room so yes it should be fast and like that the safeness status is passing if you want to use banking apps on your device you can use them and almost every banking app should work google pay paytm other kind of banking apps should work definitely fine not sure about phone pay as many users are getting some issues in the phone pay app but not sure if it is working for you it's great if it is not working for you bad luck for you talking about the safeness status as i previously told you almost everything seems to be good basic integrity is true cts profile is also true which means the safeness status is passing actually i'm using a magisk module called android 12 emojis unreleased android 12 emojis by rkbdi i have a video on this one too so if you haven't checked it out that video make sure to check out that video and you can easily use android 12 emojis right now on your device to pass the safeness status i have applied the magisk hide option in the settings so you also need this option to enable if you want to pass the safeness status on your device talking about the other things about this build almost everything seems to be good here if we talk about the camera, it comes with the MIUI camera pre-installed. It comes with the MIUI 11 camera and if you have used MIUI 12 on your device, MIUI 12 has a very different and unique kind of camera but in MIUI 11 you don't have that kind of camera UI. But yes, it is absolutely working fine. 48 megapixel, all the ultra wide lens is wide angle lens, almost everything seems to be good and working. So no issues in the camera. In my case, it's everything quite good. You can use this room on your device and also try to install Gcam etc on your device if you want to. We have many Gcam options available. For example, Gcam 7, Gcam 8, Gcam 8.1, the latest Gcam 8.1 which includes many features. It's good here. The default camera has a lot of filters as you previously saw and also has option to use the gcam so everything is actually quite good the pixie sos comes with the app locker which is quite good it's, it has the app locker in the default launcher you don't require any kind of extra options to enable you don't require any kind of third party app to install app locker to use app locker if you want to use app locker then it's available for you it's kind of a positive thing for you actually talking about some other things moving on to the settings and let me show you one more thing by going into play store if you move on to the settings you can see the device is certified so yes safeness it is is passing device play product certification also matters a lot and yes if your device is certified it's actually quite good and you will still be able to use banking apps as i previously mentioned you status bar quick settings related customizations as expectedly are available there as i previously already mentioned you that it comes with some bit of customizations not actually a lot but only bit of customizations notification related customizations lock screen related customizations and including that ambient music ticker we have some buttons and gestures related customization gestures like swipe to screenshot and quick touch etc other things same here security fingerprint options are available there but not face unlock and everything else is almost same these are the things I just wanted to let you know about Pixie SOS and if you want to install this build as expected link is in the description. This is all don't forget to like and share this video if you're new here don't forget to subscribe goodbye.
over the edge Feel like I'm floating through the air 